Good morning, everyone. We have a special guest here today to tell us more about Canada. I would like to introduce to you the Consul General of Canada in Ho Chi Minh City, Mr. Audrey Mukhopadhyay. Good morning, Your Excellency. Good morning, Dylan. Great to see you. What would you like to talk about today? Mr. Consul General, in previous discussions, we have talked about many fascinating places in Canada. Today, I was hoping you could tell us about a great Canadian inventor. Could you tell us about James Naismith? It would be my pleasure. James Naismith was born in 1861, six years before Canada became a country. His parents were both born in Scotland and immigrated to what was then known as Upper Canada. Dr. Naismith is most well known as the founder of basketball. He was an innovator, educator, and a medical doctor. He was also the first director of athletics at McGill University in Montreal, Quebec. How did James Naismith come up with the idea for basketball, which is now one of the most popular team sports in the world? That's a great question. James Naismith was interested in creating an indoor sport that would keep his students active and engaged during the cold winter months. It was challenging, but after researching the rules of popular outdoor team sports, Dr. Naismith was able to come up with the rules for a sport that focused on skill and could be played indoors in a gymnasium. Dr. Naismith may have found some inspiration from a game that he used to play with his friends as a child. They called it duck on a rock and it involved precision throwing to knock a small rock off of a bigger rock. When basketball was invented, was it played the same as it is today? The game of basketball has changed a lot since it was created in 1861. When basketball was first played, it was done using a soccer ball. The nets, much different from today, were peach baskets. In order to score a point, the ball had to land in the basket and remain there, and then someone would have to climb up to retrieve it. James Naismith created 13 rules for the game. And over time, the game has evolved into what we play today. Was basketball popular when it was invented? Basketball started to become popular quickly. In fact, even during James Naismith's lifetime, basketball was introduced as an Olympic sport and he was able to toss up the first ball at the opening game. Basketball is now played by an estimated 300 million people in nearly every country worldwide. Mr. Consul General, thank you for telling us about James Naismith, the founder of basketball. You're welcome, Dylan. It, it was fun to speak with you. Until next time, keep smiling and be curious. <laughs>